In this lecture, we solve the system of equations using the addition method. The system given to us is 2x plus 3y equals 1, 3x minus 5y equals negative 8. Addition method is also referred to as elimination method. We want to make, to use the addition method, we want the system of equations in the standard form. We want the terms involving the variables on the left-hand side and the numbers on the right-hand side. This given system is already in the standard form. To solve for the variables x and y using the addition method, we want the coefficients of the variable to be opposite. In this example, the coefficients of the variables are not opposite. So we want to make them opposite. There are several ways to make them opposite. One of the ways is to multiply the first equation by negative 3 and the bottom equation by positive 2. Observe that I, I get negative 3 by flipping the sign for the coefficient of x in the bottom equation. I get the 2 by retaining the same number, same sign, for the coefficient of x in the equation 1. Now, let's distribute negative 3 for each of the terms in the equation 1. Distributing negative 3, we get negative 6x minus 9y equals negative 3. Now, let's distribute positive 2 for each of the terms in the equation 2. Distributing the 2, we get 6x minus 10y equals 2 times negative 8 is negative 16. Now, you can, we can see that the coefficients of the variable x are opposite. Hence, we add these two equations. When we add these two equations, we get 0x minus 19y equals negative 19. Combining the terms on the left hand side we get negative 19y equals negative 19. To find the value of y we divide both sides of this equation by negative 19. Dividing both sides of this equation by negative 19 we get y equals 1. We want to find the value of the variable x by substituting y equals 1 in either equation 1 or equation 2. For convenience, let's choose the equation 1. Substitute y equals 1 in 2x plus 3y equals 1. Substituting y equals 1 in this equation, we get 2x plus 3 times 1 equals 1. Simplifying the left-hand side, we get 2x plus 3 equals 1. Now, isolating the 2x on the left-hand side, we subtract 3 on both sides of this equation. By doing that, we get 2x equals negative 2. Now, to isolate the variable x, on the left-hand side of the equation, we divide by 2 on both sides of this equation. So, dividing both sides by 2, we get x equals negative 1. Hence, negative 1 and 1 is the solution to the system. This system has two equations, and these two equations represent two lines. These two lines intersect at the point negative 1 and positive 1. Hence, the system is referred to as consistent and 
independent. This system represents intersecting lines. To summarize, we considered a system of linear equations and solved it by the addition method. The coefficients of the variables in this given system are not opposite. By multiplying with the suitable constants, we made the coefficients of the variable opposite and then solve for the variables. <laughs>